now the first example is if x is an exponential variate with mean 3 find p of x greater than 1 and second one p of x less than 3 no we know that the exponential variate is given by f of x is equal to alpha e raised to minus alpha where alpha lying between 0 to infinity ok so x greater than 0 means end point is what here infinity positive side and 0 otherwise now as per the given question the mean is given by mean means the mean stand for mu which is nothing but 1 upon alpha so it is given by how much here 3 is equal to 1 upon alpha so they have given the value of mean mean is nothing but notationally in the exponential distribution is 1 upon alpha which is defined as, which is given in the question as 3 so 3 is equal to 1 upon alpha or alpha is equal to 1 by 3 so we got the alpha value now so if once we got the alpha value our given function f of x will be replace this alpha value as 1 by 3 which is nothing but f of x is equal to 1 by 3 times e raised to minus x upon 3 where x is lying between 0 and infinity. So with the help of this we will go for the first result p of x greater than 1 and second result p of x uh, p of x greater than 1 and p of x less than 3. Now the first one p of x greater than 1. So p of x greater than 1 means what here uh, it will start with 1 end with infinity. So better we will uh, rearrange this one as 1 minus p of x less than or equal to 1 which is nothing but 1 minus so less than or equal to 1 means it will start with 0 because positive value is what here it will start with a 0 end with 1 less than or equal to 1 here. So therefore f of x and we know that f of x is nothing but what here 1 by 3 times e raised to minus x upon 3 into dx and simplify apply upper and lower limits and just see that we are going to get e raised to minus 1 by 3 you check this calc value in the calculator uh, you will find the answer as 0 0.7165 similarly second one p of x strictly less than 3 strictly less than 3 or less than or equal to 3 both we are going to consider as what here uh, this value here for the integral so therefore 0 to 3 x less than 3 means we are going to consider the range 0 to 3 only of f of x dx so therefore we know that uh, our f of x is 1 by 3 times e raised to minus x upon 3 dx so on simplification uh, of the upper and lower limit so we will get the answer as 0 0.6321 so in this way we are going to simplify the problems of exponential distribution next example is 